Hello everyone and welcome in. Hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, the viewers, and the world out there. Today we're looking into Aquarius's monthly overview for June 2021. In this message, we're first going to tap into the energies here with the Psychic Tarot deck. In this message, we are going to tap into the energy surrounding you this month, Aquarius. The energy in love, the energy in money. We'll see what's challenging. It's working in your favor. And we'll look at the advice guidance moving forward. Clarify as well as pull a few oracle cards at the end. If that's something you guys are interested in, you're more than welcome in joining us. let's see here Aquarius what we can see for you guys for June 2021 please thank you the most important message here for Aquarius spirit what does Aquarius need to see for this upcoming month? definitely feel like a situation here is coming to an end Aquarius something that you had your heart set on something that I feel is very near and dear to your heart okay trying to have patience and understanding through this process will help you um, self-awareness is going to be key okay the transformation this is death energy this is talking about something to be significant to be learned out of this ending, okay? With any ending comes a new beginning, right? Entering a new phase, okay? Especially if it's a significant loss, such as an ending of a significant relationship. Maybe this is moving from one location to another, something along those lines, okay? Something here, Aquarius, that you thought was meant for you, I feel here is moving away, okay? Or there's becoming this, there's something that's ending, that's closing out, okay? And I feel like there's going to be a distance if this is having to do with a relationship. I feel like there's going to be some sort of distance and you're trying to come to this understanding, this internal understanding, and just having patience with this process is going to be important. So let's take a little bit deeper look into the energies here, Aquarius. Please keep in mind, guys, that the messages here on YouTube are general. They're not going to resonate every time with every person. It's really about the title. There's something in the title resonating. There's most likely going to be something in the message for you. For information on energy cleanse kits, personal readings, extended versions, it's all linked below. And Aquarius, if you like the vibe or how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome here, and it does help to set intentions for future messages. So Aquarius, okay. Energy surrounding you this month is new beginning. This is the full energy. Something new. The message that always comes with this card, guys, is look before you leap. Pay attention. Pay attention to your next steps moving forward, the path ahead of you. Um, this is a new beginning, a new phase. I feel like you guys are moving into... It depends on where on the timeline that you're at. Some of you are closing out a chapter and you're kind of in the midst of that ending and uh, others of you have already moved forward from whatever closed out there is an energy of holding back not speak not saying what you want to say okay now maybe this was how you felt in a particular situation maybe this was an idea or um an opinion but there was definitely something of withholding Okay, withholding what you needed to say. Aquarius, I don't feel like that was the best approach that you could have had in this scenario. We're going to dig a little bit deeper into that energy here in, in a minute. The positive thing here, Aquarius, is there's some positive changes that are happening when it comes to finances, when it comes to career. 
Maybe you guys are starting a new job, a new business venture. There are still some challenges that you are going to face, but this new beginning, this new opportunity is helping you to take your mind off of this loss that you've experienced, okay? I do feel like a lot of you are moving forward into a calmer space, okay? So let's clarify the energies here, Aquarius. If you found this message has been helpful up to this point, resonating with your situation, thumbs up is always very much appreciated and it does help with the growth of the channel. There's some clarity coming in, okay? Something is going to come out, okay? Whether this is a message for some of you, um, maybe this is just seeing something or an intuitive feeling, but I feel here there's going to be something that's going to be revealed that's going to help you through this transition. Now, it could be the fact that you, um, something negative about the person that ended the situation or that you ended the situation with, you may find out something and you can look back and be like, oh, well, it's a good thing that I walked away from that situation. Um, but I do feel like there, everything happens for a reason here, Aquarius, and whether you are able to see this or this is going to be coming out very soon, I feel like there's going to be this understanding of why this ending took place. I've, for a lot of you, finding the internal balance has been difficult. Okay, rebalancing, recalibrating your energy. Um, what I would say to that is just taking it one day at a time, one step at a time, and even just being aware, you know, that you're being triggered that you're having a difficult time will help you to move through the energy. Six of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, okay? Slow and steady wins the race. I know that's so cliche, all the readers say it, but taking a slower approach to the process will help you to find that internal balance a lot easier and even coming to terms, learning the lesson a little bit deeper. So that way you don't have a chance to make that mistake again suffering in silence nine of swords i feel like there is some something that you weren't saying okay aquarius there's something that you weren't saying maybe it was a, a friendship that you were in agreement with maybe this was how you're you were feeling in this connection in a particular situation but i feel here that this is part of the reason why you chose to walk away or why you cho chose to end the situation okay queen of cups in the reverse three of cups in the reverse okay a lot of you this was definitely having to do with how you were feeling your emotions maybe it was pertaining to what you needed in the connection to feel stable to feel secure i feel that there is an energy that this worry this caused a lot of worry, this caused a lot of stress, you not being able to express yourself fully in this aspect, in this connection. What's clarifying this new beginning here, Aquarius, as I said before, whatever is happening within your career in, the, in a business venture, okay, it's causing this it, for one, it's causing you to take your mind off of this ending, but it's also helping you to transform this energy, right? To let go of this ending a lot quicker because you have things to look forward to. There are things that you're working on moving forward into the future, okay? The challenges here, I feel like someone was lying about a connection, okay? For some of you, this person may have been manipulating the situation. There was something that they were gaining out of this connection that you may have, this may have been part of what you found out, Aquarius, or what you will find out. I feel here that you're releasing that. You're walking away from anything, person, place, or thing. It's no longer serving. That may have had you up in your head, causing a lot of stress, worry, anxiety, and moving forward to more positive things. Okay. It's like you're making a decision here, Aquarius, to leave the lies behind you. 
Okay, to move forward from any negative lower vibrating person, place, or thing, and maybe not even responding to that, right? Not entertaining, okay? Clarifying the Six of Swords, this is what's working in your favor. I feel here, Aquarius, this kind of coming to terms with you need to move forward is what's working in your favor. Finally making a decision. For some of you, you may be expressing that what you were holding back, right? That part of you that you were hiding. Two of Pentacles, Page of Cups. I still feel an energy of maybe holding back, okay? But coming forward, expressing yourself, okay? It's a beautiful thing, Aquarius. And trust the process here, okay? This is, a, this is for the month of June, okay? So what I see here is... By expressing yourself, it's not only transforming yourself and, and maybe your perspective on connections or how you react in certain situations, but I feel here there may be something else that this is going to transform in this process, and you're not going to see this until a later date, okay? You're not going to see this until later on down the line, okay? The advice guidance moving forward if you have found this message has been helpful that it's resonating with your situation please give it a thumbs up all the love and support is very much appreciated it does help with the growth of the channel getting the message out there so thank you guys so much for that you are all freaking amazing also guys i am going to do an extended version to the reading in the extended version we're going to take a little bit deeper look into the energies We'll see where this is all headed, what's next, okay, moving forward. We'll look into the hidden energy, see if there's anything hidden that you need to be made aware of, let that come to the forefront. We'll look at the resolution to the challenge and the outcome if the advice is followed. It's all going down in the extended version and the links are all below. Aquarius, clarifying this heart chakra is King of Swords, Ace of Cups. I feel here for those of you that haven't expressed that part of you that you were holding back on. You need to say something. You need to speak up. Whether this is um, you were hurt in this situation, in this dynamic, okay? What needs were, weren't being met or how a person was making you feel in a particular situation. I feel here there needs to be, you need to find a way to express yourself in some way, shape, or form. Whether this is journaling it out, you need to get that off of your chest. I also feel here it's not good to withhold parts of you in any connection. So coming to terms with why you felt like you needed to hold back, maybe questioning um, that part of you. It's going to be important here because I feel like that is part of the lesson that needs to be learned moving forward. That's part of the challenge that you're finding is you're having a difficult time expressing your emotions or your needs here in this, in not only this connection, but what's coming through here in this reading. Okay. So what I would encourage you to look into, to question is that part of you that's kind of holding back but a little bit deeper into that, um, maybe question why, why you feel like you need to hold back, okay? New beginning, okay, there are going to be some new things that are coming in, but just being very honest, very practical with yourself at this time, are you ready to move forward? Is there still healing that needs to take place? Um, are you still releasing that old connection? Or maybe if that person comes back, are you ready to try again? These are all going to be important things, questions that you discover moving forward. But I do feel here, Aquarius, that there is definitely going to be a need, maybe even an opportunity to express that part of you that you are holding back. I do feel an energy of leaving the lies behind. Okay, so trusting the process in that aspect. So, Aquarius, let's get this soul journey message coming out for your 
reading. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all freaking amazing. Again, if you want to get in on the extended version, the links are all below. We have grief. I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. Nothing has gone forever. The belief that we have lost something or someone is merely an illusion to assist us in learning to appreciate or having had it in the first place. The emotion of grief and the sense of loss are absolutely real, but that's the point. The lesson of loss is not about the actual physical separation because the parting is temporary and illusory. The point of the lesson is to acknowledge that the bonds of love never end and that we have not been abandoned. When you accept in your heart that you will be re reunited with everything you've ever loved, it will give you the ability to move beyond your grief and derive something beneficial from the experience. To wallow in grief is to pass up the opportunity that you or your soul family have devised and learn nothing. Instead, allow your grief to take you to a place of deeper understanding. So try this month Aquarius to look deeper into the meaning behind certain feelings certain things certain reactions to the things that you do it's going to be important here moving forward and also for this healing process so Aquarius let's get your four truths message out thank you guys so much for all the love and support Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all freaking amazing. Four Truths message Aquarius is be impeccable with your word. Express your love. Interesting. Impeccability of the word can be measured by your level of self-love. If you love yourself, you will express that you love in your interactions with others. And the action will produce a like reaction. Express your love. There's definitely a need coming out here, Aquarius, to express yourself. Something that you were holding back saying for a long time. So, Aquarius, that is the message I have coming out for you guys for this month. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. Thank you for liking, subscribing, sharing the content. You guys are all freaking amazing you want to get in on the extended version the links are all below otherwise thank you guys again and i look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon namaste